New Female Robot, Weekly Boston Dynamics News Boston Dynamics stays at the forefront of all news robotics. Let's take a look at the latest happenings in the world of Boston Dynamics. Spot, Roboverse Reply wins ERA Challenge 2022. Roboverse Reply, the reply group company specialized in integration scenarios around robotics and the industrial metaverse, is the winner of the ERA Challenge, or Advanced Industrial Robotic Applications, an international competition to automate inspection in chemical production facilities by leveraging on robotics technology. The challenge was held during Akema 2022 in Frankfurt, the world's largest trade fair for the process industry. The competition, launched by a consortium of five of the world's leading chemical and pharmaceutical companies, including BASF, Bayer, Boehringer Ingelheim, Merck, and Wacker, promotes the development of new ideas and practical applications. Six teams with five different autonomous mobile robots competed to solve recurring tasks, such as safety tours in chemical and pharmaceutical plants. The tasks were to navigate autonomously through a chemical facility, handle typical floor types of a chemical plant environment, and overcome obstacles, find and monitor a gauge and document its rating, transport a sample while collecting data, and more. The last task was to develop a concept that enables a quick and easy tool change on the robot to make it more flexible and versatile. Roboverse Reply experts developed a solution with the agile mobile robot Spot from Boston Dynamics for these automated routine inspections, data capture tasks, and convinced the jury with consistent, high performance, and mastery of all the given missions. Autonomous mobile robots like Spot are agile and offer tremendous flexibility to automate tasks, especially in hazardous areas. In our robotics lab, we are already working on the next generation of robotic solutions. The real-world metaverse provides a common reference for AI computer vision, allowing it to collaborate with spatial computing devices like AR and VR tools and robots. This will take autonomous mobile robot navigation to the next level, said Filippo Rizzante, CTO of Reply. We are delighted to have won the prestigious ERA competition, which affirms our leadership in implementing highly innovative robotic use cases. Spot, a price tag of $75,000. As many people adopted or fostered dogs and cats while staying home during the COVID-19 pandemic, there's a different kind of pet that can help businesses. Spot, a robot dog created by engineering company Boston Dynamics. Spot is not a house pet or a toy for entertainment. It's a four-legged robot that can walk up to three miles per hour, climb terrain, avoid obstacles, see 360 degrees, and perform a number of programmed tasks. Now, Spot is available to purchase from Boston Dynamics for $75,000. Spot debuted in 2015, but was only made commercially available recently. With its canine appearance and human-like movements, Spot has experienced its fair share of internet fame. Videos of Spot dancing, opening doors, and even pulling a truck have gone viral on the Boston Dynamics YouTube channel. Michael Perry, VP of Business Development at Boston Dynamics, says Spot has seemingly limitless applications for businesses. The robot can be operated remotely, or it can learn custom routes and actions so that it can perform autonomous missions. In an early adopter test program, people at businesses and research facilities employed 150 Spot robots to do things such as document construction progress, monitor remote or hazardous environments, and provide situational awareness, Perry says. Spot robots were used in a variety of environments, including power generation facilities, decommissioned nuclear sites, factory floors, construction sites, and research laboratories. Scary Army Robot Dog Has Tail for Swimming Boston Dynamics Spot may be famous for grabbing beer cans and other fun stuff, but the machine dog, developed by Ghost Robotics, was meant to be a trooper's best friend. It can tackle challenging terrain, inspect dangerous areas, and even carry a weapon. Starting now, it will also be able to cross small bodies of water, making it the animal-inspired version of a military vehicle. That's possible due to a brand new tail for the Vision 60 dog. It's called Knot, Nautical Autonomous Unmanned Tail, and it was developed by Onyx Industries for Ghost Robotics. This is basically an underwater propulsion system that helps Vision 60 move with vectored thrust in a body of water. This autonomous tail can operate for approximately 35 minutes using a dedicated power source, 
and then continue to function using the robot dog's internal power source. Don't imagine the Vision 60 dog cutting through the waves like a professional swimmer. Knot can only propel the robot dog at about 3 knots, or 3.4 miles per hour, or 5.4 kilometers per hour. But that's enough to enable the QUGV to make its way through streams and calm waters. If watching a four-legged robot climb terrains or move around with agility isn't impressive enough, seeing the Ghost Robotics dog swim is pretty mind-blowing. It sported a rifle, which freaked everyone out, it now boasts a tail, and there are still things to come for the Vision 60. The versatility of this robot dog hasn't met its limits so far. Boston Dynamics makes fun of Tesla Optimus. Elon Musk put someone in a spandex suit to dance on a stage during AI Day. Supposedly, that was to demonstrate what the next big thing for Tesla would be. In the end, it just got people asking whether he was mocking Tesla or the people who believed in that promise. A remarkable silence from robotics companies followed until Boston Dynamics decided to make fun of the situation, even if trying to make it look like it didn't. In its latest video about Spot, the company created a dancing session not wanting to entertain investors, but rather for a more practical and noble goal. When the video starts, Murray, the technician, tries to interact with the four-legged robot in many situations as if it was a sentient being. Perhaps trying to avoid any association with what Musk did, the video presents the worker watching one of the videos made by Boston Dynamics in which its robots also dance. That reminds us that Musk may have tried to mock the robotics company with the spandex person to start with. After all, Boston Dynamics made these videos to demonstrate how its robots could perform complex movements. The bottom line is that Murray is convinced Spot can dance. The robotics company shows all resources the robot has, such as detecting thermal anomalies and reading analog gauges, while the technician tries to feed the robot with bolts and nuts or invite it to dance. When they meet in a stairway, the robot finally does what Murray expects. Not because they are just dogs in spandex suits, mind you. The plot twist is that Spot controllers give Murray what he wants so that he can go back to fixing the issues the robot detected in the factory. Stretch is already sold out for 2022. Who doesn't know Spot, the yellow robot dog that impressed an entire world with its tricks? Although it's not as cute and popular, Spot's younger brother, named Stretch, is an equally remarkable futuristic machine. It may not be a celebrity yet but it's already sold out for its first year of production. A year ago, Boston Dynamics introduced Stretch in a video that showed how the warehouse and logistics robot picked up Spot himself from a box. Now, its production version is on display at the Modex show in Atlanta, and the company announced that Stretch is available for commercial purchase. That is, for 2023 and 2024 deliveries, because it's sold out through 2022. The reason is that some of the customers that tested the robot prior to its official launch were so impressed that there was a strong pre-order demand. These customers include DHL Supply Chain, which committed to a $15 million pre-order, and performance team Amersk Company. Boston Dynamics claims that Stretch is not just a game-changing mobile platform for logistics operations, but one of the most advanced robots in the world. That's all for this video, folks. See you another time.